Designing an imaging solution for a vision system requires understanding of the complete environment factors such as the lighting as well as the target characteristics as in whether the target is moving or is stationary or how far it is from the uh, camera. So uh, understanding all these factors uh, lead to a reliable imaging solution. Uh, in this video we are going to discuss about the right imaging solution when the target is moving. CMOS cameras can be categorized into two types based on their shutter uh, technique uh, it is a rolling shutter versus a global shutter. In a rolling shutter camera, the pixels of the camera are exposed line by line towards the uh, target whereas in a global shutter camera, all the pixels are exposed at the same time towards the target. So going by this definition, it's obvious that a global shutter camera is more suitable for capturing moving targets. So is a global shutter camera enough to combat this motion blur? Not always. Even when the pixels are all exposed at the same time towards the target, if they are exposed for a longer enough time, the target would have moved and there would still be motion blur. So what do we do on this? We go for a low exposure rate or a fast shutter rate, where the sensor is exposed for a minimal time towards the target in which the uh, details of the target can be captured. And this raises a new problem or a new challenge where the illumination might not be sufficient for the target to be captured reliably. Therefore, external illumination might also be required to capture these fast moving objects along with a fast exposure and a global shutter technique. So, when you are designing an imaging solution for your moving targets, make sure you have the right shutter technique then the fast exposure technique as well as a good illumination to capture the image reliably. Here at Ecom Systems, our camera experts would be happy to answer your queries on embedded vision and related techniques. Please let us know your queries in the comment section below. Thank you.